Hello and welcome once again. Today we are going to learn how to create this cute crop top. What we will need are our yarn, our hook, our scissors and our needle. We will start off by creating our slip knot. We will insert our hook and we are going to create 51 chains because that's the length that I prefer. If you prefer longer or shorter length, you can either increase or reduce. We have our 51 chains now and we are going to create half double crochet or across till the end. Half double crochet. So we will yarn over and insert, yarn over and pull through, yarn over and pull through all three stitches on the hook. Have double crochet till we get to the very end. So kindly do it and I will meet you at the end. We are at the very end, so what we will do is we are going to chain one and we will turn our work. We are going to create it on the upper loop. So we will yarn over and insert at the upper loop, yarn over and pull through, yarn over and pull through all three stitches on the hook. It's the same thing, just that this time we are inserting at the upper loop. So once again, I would advise you crochet down to the end till we have only one stitch left and I will meet you. We have one more stitch left but this time we are going to insert into both loops to make our work more firm. It's kind of obscured but we are going to insert into both loops to secure the end. We are going to work vertically so it can wrap around your body. I have created 80 rows and we are going to seam together by single crochet. You can either seam it together with your darning needle or you can slip stitch together or you can single crochet whichever way that you prefer is okay. And I'll meet you at the end. We have seen it together in the middle here and we are going to continue with a single crochet all around at the upper part of the crop top. We are going to go all around and I will meet you. We have gone all around with our single crochet at the upper part. At the bottom part, we did not single crochet. We are now going to create our lace at the bottom part of the crop top with a white yarn to make it stand out. If you like, you can use any color that you prefer. We are going to create two chains and double crochet and chain one and we are going to create two double crochet at the same spot. The 
then we will single crochet then we are going to repeat two double crochet chain one two double crochet at the same spot so that's the pattern that we are going to follow two double crochet chain one two double crochet at the same spot we are going to go all around and I'll meet you at the end we have gone all around and we are going to create the next row so we will slip stitch we will slip stitch again and we are going to chain two representing one double crochet then double crochet again and chain one double crochet and double crochet going to single crochet on top of the single crochet we created so that is what we have right now we are now going to attach our straps we will create our slip knot insert our hook and we are going to create 41 chains that is what we are going to use for our strap and create half double crochet till we get to the very end We will slip stitch and tie it off. Snip it off and tie off the ends. We are now going to attach our straps together. And I attached this cute flower to it and this is the end product of our crop top. Please, if you like it, give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and have a lovely day. Bye!